So where do I start? Being born in the 90s <laughs> is the best. We had Pokemon. Pokemon, are you dumb? Like, there's not so much limits as to what we can achieve, especially, for example, nowadays you're seeing like people born in the 90s, so I'd say 16 plus now, they're able to do things like create their own apps, create their own websites, be young entrepreneurs, millionaires, you know? You couldn't do that back in the 70s, 80s, you know? I had this debate with someone recently, and they said to me, if I had, um, if I had the choice to be born slightly just before the 90s, so maybe 70s or 80s, and start now, or, or be born in the 90s, sorry, when would I rather be born? And I thought about it, I was, I was thinking about this one, this one was quite a hard one at first, you know, because I look at the sort of things that I could have um, profited from and, you know, that would have been better for me, like the big internet boom and telecoms and all those sort of things. Like if I wanted to start a business and stuff back in the 70s, 80s, now probably be booming. But then I said to myself, do you know what, actually, looking back at my life, my experiences and the people I've grown up with and what I've actually experienced seeing, social media and things, I would say now, any day. I said, things like Twitter, Facebook, they weren't around back in the 90s. I tell you the one reason why 90s babies are the best, we had Rugrats. Hey, listen, Rugrats, I said to God, Rugrats was the best program going. There was a few that was up there with it. Okay, okay, okay. That's a lie, that's a lie. That is a big lie. That is a very big lie. Pokemon was the best program going. Even Beyblade, Beyblade was up there. Beyblade was up there. They were talking about these programs. It's like, you're too young to remember those programs. They said to me, oh, we would know these things better than you because we was born slightly before you. So we was older when we saw these things. I'm thinking, so what? Do you know what I mean? You guys didn't even see That's a Raven. You guys got too old for that. You know what I mean? That's a Raven was also a bad boy. The Sweet Life and Zack and Cody. All these things. Oh, mate. 90s babies are the best. Don't tell me nothing. I don't want to hear it. All the comments below, don't want to hear it, yeah? There is a lot of pressures being born in the 90s. And I think it's more internal with everyone. And you see it in a lot of people. A lot of people don't like to talk about it or don't mention it. Everyone wants to be great. Everyone born in my generation just wants to be great at something. You've seen the likes of um, talented sports stars and talented musicians and all these things from the 70s and 80s doing amazing for themselves now and we want that for ourselves and that like, you see it everyone using their social media platforms to get as big as they can as quick as they can and you know earn millions and be this and be that and that wouldn't have been achievable back in the 80s is what I'm saying they're no longer like the old teenagers the ones that are going I don't even know play pat ball and that on the wall do you know what gets to me the most people who are much older than us don't think we know much about before our time. They think all we know is nowadays and 21st century and technology and social media. Although, do you know what would have been like all my days? Being 18 in two, the year 2000. Honestly, if I was 18 in when the clocks ticked over from 1999 to 2000, that would have been the best New Year's Eve ever. I can imagine that New Year's Eve would have been a mad thing. You know the ones when you go home and you've got no brain cells left? It's just pure dribble and just sleep. I just want to say thank you for watching my first video. It was just a quick upload to uh, really introduce my channel and just to talk about a topic that I've, ha I've been speaking about a lot lately. So I thought, you know what, let me just cover this topic on my YouTube channel. So I did. So like, comment, subscribe, all those other things people say. Also follow me on Twitter and Instagram, uh, Den the God, D-E-N-T-H-A-G-O-D. Um, for like tweets and funny shit that I talk about yeah uh, new videos I will try and get them out every week hopefully Sundays and Wednesdays but anyway thanks for watching